What's up everybody? Welcome back to Team Fishnables Youth Channel. Today is Fan Friday and the winner was Orbeetle. Uh, this suggestion was uh, submitted by Ben and um, I am not sure how to play this deck. So Orbeetle has attacked Evo Mancy. For each energy attached to this Pokemon, search for a stage 2 Pokemon except Orbeetle and put it onto your bench, then shuffle your deck. Uh, so the whole point of the deck is to pretty much just annoy your opponent because you have a bunch of stage 2 Pokemon that can counter your opponent's side of the field and that is what we're going to try to do today. Alright, so let's go over all the different stage 2s. I'm going to try my best to play this as best as I can, I guess? Uh, so Statland makes it where your opponent can't play any sort of portal cards from their hand if he's active, so it can shut down supporter cards. We have Obstagoon, which has Wicked Ruler. What's your turn? You may have your opponent discard cards from their hands. They have four cards in their hand, so you make it where they have four uh, when they have a, when they have cards. Uh, we have Dragonite. Once you're turn, you may put a search deck for a supporter card, reveal it, and put it in your hand. So this is going to help uh, basically find supporter cards be super you know quick and consistent. Uh, we have Blitbug, Dottler, and of course Orbeetle is your main guy. Uh, we have Decidueye, which makes where V and GX cannot hurt you, which can just shut down some decks so they can't if they don't have a counter to this. We have Valplume, which make it where each player can't put item cards in their hand. And we have the other Valplume, which makes it where basic Pokemon can attack. So not only do you have, you know, this is in your active your opponent, your base your opponent, your opponent's base Pokemon can attack. We have, you know, this one, which makes it V and GX can't hurt you. We have this one, which just basic Pokemon can't attack you. We have Magnezone, so you can use two supporter cards. We have uh, Zashi for Intrepid Sword to help set up and draw three cards. And we have Dusnor with Spectral Breach. All special energy attached to Pokemon, both yours and your opponents provide one colors. So if your opponent's special energy deck, you shut them down. So there's a bunch of different things happening here. Uh, so we got to remember, this is for V and GX to counter those decks. This is for basics. This is to shut down item cards. This is to shut down supporter cards if it's active. We have Obstagoon, which can uh, mill their hand to four. We have Dragonite that can find supporter cards. Magnezone to let you play two supporter cards. And Dusnor to shut down special energies. Do you get all that? That's a lot to remember. We're going to try our best, uh, depending on the different situations, who is active and who is not. Um, outside of that, there is a Douse Machine. Discard two cards from your hand. Put a trainer card from your scroll into your hand. Be able to gear to tools if need be. One Nass Ball to search for base Pokemon put onto your bench. We have four Communication and four Water Candy. Those are pretty much MVP in this deck. We need those over and over again. Uh, we have one Stretcher to get back our Pokemon if needed. One uh, Pass to the Peak to make where Pokemon V and GX have no abilities. Uh, we have one Sound Lab to shut down basic Pokemon's abilities in general. And then here are all our supporter cards. Okay, so this is a lot. Uh, we have AZ to put a Pokemon back into your hand. We have Cheryl, which can heal all damage from each of your evolution Pokemon if you do just call energy attached to it. We have Faba that can discard a tool or special energy card. We have Gladian, which can search, look at your face down price cards, put one in your hand, then shuffle Gladian in there. When one Guzman search to shuffle both, uh, to switch both active. Loose Mean is how we're getting back our supporter cards. Put two of incarnation of supporter cards and statement cards from your scroll into your deck. So this is pretty much going to help us loop a supporter cards over and over again. We have End to Disrupt. We have a new card, Peone, Peona. Uh, put up to three prize cards into your hand. Then for each prize card put in your hand in this way, put a card from your hand face down as prize cards. So basically you can just grab three prize cards and put three prize cards down that you don't need in special situations. We have one Plumerina uh, to discard energy. Discard two cards in your hand if you do discard energy from one of your opponent's Pokemon. We have Ranger to shut down ADP. We have four Stevens Resolve so we can find any three cards in our deck. We have one Team Flare to discard energy from the active. We have one Team Rocket's Handiwork to flip two coins for each has discard energy. Four teammates to look for any two cards in our deck if a Pokemon's knocked out. Four triple, triple Solar Energy, which counts as three energies, which is fantastic because it makes sure Obord, Obrido has three for Evil Mancy, and we have four Capture Energy. So that's all the stuff we're playing. It's a lot to do. We're going to see what happens, see how bad this goes because I feel like it's going to go terrible. I guess we could technically wild tackle. I'm thinking about this. Um, <laughs> I don't think it's a tack you ever want to use. And uh, we're going to see how the Stage 2 deck works. It seems kind of complicated. Um... Especially with like the one of every supporter card and stuff like that, and uh, I, uh, yeah, we'll see. Especially with the four teammates and like four team resolve, I guess is okay. You get rare candy and whatever you want. Uh, so let's see. Yeah, search your deck for a stage two. So this is searching our deck. So we're gonna play Orbeetle. We're gonna see how this goes. We're gonna try our best. 
Um, it's just hard remembering all the one ups. This is why I can't be a male player. Because, like, if you notice, there was like 50 million one of sporter cards, but they are in there because we have Lucimine. If Lucimine was banned still, we would not have decks like this exist. Um, so, thanks for Pokemon for unbanning Lucimine, I guess. I have no idea. Uh, so, let's go find Ore Beetle. There it goes. Hit play. Oh, okay. Mainly found a Pokemon or opponent. Kyo Kimbo. All right. I have no idea. Uh, we want to go first, of course. Call heads. Lost point flip, so we are going second, most likely. I don't see any disadvantage of going uh, not first. So uh, we start Zacian. We have Stevens, but then we have to end a turn. Uh, everything else, I don't want to use this card yet because we don't know what our opponent's playing. Looks like we're playing against um, Garbodor Necrozma. So if we essentially get Volplum out, they, they can't hurt us. So we got this, press done, Trubbish. Uh, we do have ways to discard their energies, of course. So that's gonna be pretty good. <clears throat> Float still in the active. Mysterious treasure, probably grab a Necrozma. Most likely. Um, I don't know what support card I really want. I guess we can just like teammates and grab like rare candy. Uh, or beetle triple acceleration triple acceleration energy but this deck doesn't play guzman either i guess because you have four blip bug and like two of these so like in like the ideal world you start with blip bug right we didn't start with it unfortunately so that's that's not good all right and there's that floatstone retreat <clears throat> Let's see what else we got. Trainer's Mail. Look at top four cards with our deck. Let's see. What else do they have here? Yeah, I mean, the plan is pretty simple. It's just to get Valkyrie out into the active, right? And I think that will... That would definitely do us good. So. There's Marnie. Okay, so the Marnie is actually pretty upsetting. Because they're going to shuffle cards into the bottom of our deck. But that way they're not Guzman this turn. So I think Steven Resolves is the best play. We'll grab, um, let's see, we'll grab Rare Candy, Communication, and then one Triple Excel strategy just in case they don't go for that play. But they're mostly going to Marnie here, right? So, since we know they're going to Marnie, I didn't want to grab all my candies and stuff like that and all the, the good stuff. Uh, so there's a Garbodor with the Flowstone coming down. There's another Cross that comes down, so they can use a Luster of Downfall now. There's a Flowstone going to the uh, Ocean of Crossma, and we will see a Marnie, most likely. Okay, so Marnie comes down. We're going to get four, unfortunately. Let's see here. Mm. So I can dousing these two for Stevens. That's what we might have to do here. So, so many options here. Yeah, I'm gonna dousing, discard this and this to grab a Stevens. We'll play the Stevens. We'll grab Rare Candy. Triple Acceleration Energy. And then Steven resolves again. Okay. On to their turn. Let's see what they have. Another Marnie. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. But if they get knocked out, we hit teammates, then we can go for this place. So that would be okay. This is not okay. We might lose now. <laughs> uh, I mean, we don't have any other options. I mean, uh, we'll see. We'll see what we get here. There's Sound Lab. Okay, we don't care about Sound Lab. I, mean, I guess we kind of care about Sound Lab, right? 
So Sound Lock comes down. Uh, counter Energy. Lesser Downfall for Knockout. They go down to three price cards. Or four, sorry. It's not a GX. Or it's not a Tag Team. Or VMAX. Blitbug come up. And we lose. What? That's unfortunate. Okay, yeah. We just didn't find anything. Um... Yeah, I don't think we, we can't even like communication for anybody to like find another blip book and put that down. Uh, so yeah, that was unfortunate. We could have maybe like field blower got rid of like the float stone, like sound lab, and like crossed our fingers and like went for whatever. But they, they, they you, you know, they had it right. There's no way. So, mm. so we lost Quinflip again. Okay, so it's actually pretty winnable. I think if we got Valkamel and just like followed his float stone off, we just like win, right? I don't know. We start Zacian again, but we also start in, so that's good. Uh, so we'll see what we can find here. Snorlax V, okay. Um, ditto, Compressor. So in this matchup, we can go for Dusnor and we win, right? Because they, this, if it's Snorlax VMAX, they use like triple acceleration energy and stuff like that. And uh, yeah. Okay, so yeah, let's just hit him with the N. I love Snorlax VMAX. Okay. <clears throat> so we hit Blood Bug. We'll put that down. And we'll just go for the Trepid Sword. All right, so we do have it next turn, which is pretty good. We communicate this Rare Candy into the guy, but then we don't have like a really good thing off the back. So there's a Chinchino. Okay. There's a Snorlax VMAX. Compressor. If we talk about triple acceleration energy, they may look really, really good. Like, a really, really good. Um, so, that'd be really cool. Um, if not, we could still go for... Well, no, don't end me. He just discarded an N. Three eggs. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, Crobat. Or, don't Guzma my Blip Bug. My, my Blip Bug. Um, if he Guzma my Blip Bug, that's kind of okay. Because then we can, like, uh, communicate this, get another Blip Bug, capture it, find another Blip Bug, whatever. So, that's okay, I feel like. So propagate, <clears throat> okay. <coughs> Quick ball discards egg. Sudowoodo, okay. Sudowoodo comes down. Gonna show this. Oh man, it's actually pretty good. Mm. Okay. With the quickness, discards the egg. Grimer. Ooh, muck is also kind of annoying. Saw that. A lot of good cards in his deck. Hmm. Uh, discard the egg, drawn two. Machino, Machino. Got to propagate. Got to propagate. So we're gonna see an Ultra Ball most likely for Dadini. Oh, computer search. Oh, this is gonna find triple acceleration, triple acceleration energy for knockout, right? 100%, that's the play. All right, so Triple Acceleration goes away. Okay, on our turn. So let's go mm, Capture, Blit Bug. We got Dustnor. Dustnor, Vile, and we only go for one right now. So Dustnor is the play. Yeah. We at least want to play some kind of effect. So we'll loose me. For N. And then we'll Evo Mancy for Dustnor. Okay. It's probably the best player we have right there, right? I imagine so. Uh, next turn we can Steven's Resolve. Sessional X. 
Okay, got the propagate. We'll see the make do. Propagate, yeah, because this has to be active, right? Ultra Ball. Uh, so I'm going to grab Grimer, most likely. Okay, Chichino. Does Alolan Grimer do it? I mean, does Alola Muck do what I think it does? Let's see here. That's not the right Alola Muck. Here it is. Just basic Pokemon? Oh, bro, we got this. We win now, right? Unless they play Ranger. But they hit the Ranger every single turn. So I don't see how they win now. Right? They can't. The Triple Acceleration doesn't do anything now. And so we should just win the matchup, right? We should just win. I don't see a way that we don't win now. So we'll make it happen, see what happens, and just wait. Okay. Um. I think here we just like Steam and Resolve. We grab this, this. And maybe this? <gasps> oh no, I meant to grab one important card and I didn't grab it. I meant to grab, <laughs> I meant to grab triple acceleration energy. Whoops. Oh well. For Ranger? For N, okay. That's okay. Like, that doesn't work. He doesn't know what my card does. That's perfect. He doesn't, uh, play, he doesn't know what my card does. Cool. Oh, and we get triple surgery? Cool. Alright, so let's do... Okay, let's do... This first. Which will shut down a set of Wudo. We'll go triple. Hit him with the Team Rocket Sandy Wart. Evo Mancy for four? Oh, it's only two, because my card's in play now. Okay, that's fine. Okay, I wish this card was, was in my deck. Oh well, yeah, because this be this finding supporter cards would be really good right now, but we should be okay because now he's got attached three. He's got attached three of these. Hmm. Seems good, right? Can't hurt it. So I think we're fine here now. I think we're fine just passing. There's a third one. <laughs> he took a knockout on it. That's funny. Goes down to three. Send him just a joy. Uh, okay. Let's grab. Team Flaregon. And Lucimane. All right. So now we get Flicker on his like this off. All right, so he goes on a five, or goes on a two. I mean, sorry. Might be closer than I thought. We'll see. Because now he can use uh, VS Seekers and stuff like that. Special charge. Okay. Uh oh. I, I thought we had it, but we might not have it. Make do. Because then a five. 
He's got to hit Via Seeker and Energy to knock out Dustmore? I had, I had this last turn. I didn't use it. Terrible of me. Okay. Okay. The blip bug. Hmm. Well, if he's got knockout, he's got knockout, right? Oh, we can't even use it. Oh, he's probably got a game, right? He's probably got it. This is gonna let him draw the last, last triple acceleration energy. Oh, yes. He's got the VS ticket for Guzman too. Yep. Broken. Let's go, opponent. All right, let's try one more time. Ah, man, that's upsetting. That's upsetting. I was like, oh, we got this. And then, like, he's like, just kidding. I got this. And I was like, yo, that's pretty good. He just, like, mainly attached three energies. And I should have probably did a better. I, I don't think I had a way to, like, control that, though. I don't think my hand was, like, that good unless I, like, was playing very subpar, which I could have been playing very subpar. Uh, okay, so we'll go first. This is the first game we started with this guy. So that's okay. All right. So let's see here. What are we playing against? <laughs> yep. Okay. Waylord. Interesting. It's a mill versus mill. Interesting. How do we play this matchup? I don't know. Gonna be really interesting. Plumeria, discard the capture. We'll go with this. This and this. Steam and Resolve, okay. We're gonna use two supporter cards in one turn, which is probably what's gonna give us the advantage. Like double, lo like loose me every turn, it's gonna be really, really good. I like that we're playing against a mill deck. Huh. All right. Don't need in the blue bug. I think in the end we're probably the better deck, right? Uh, I don't want to grab anything, but I'm evil mancing for a stout land. Look at this setup, bro. This is so cool. 
Like, we're gonna make it where our opponent can't use <laughs> supporter cards. <laughs> Alright, probably should have. Okay, there we go. Now we win. <laughs> Uh, there we go. That's pretty cool. Uh, so that was the full effect of the deck, right? We had so many good things going there. We would have easily, like, destroyed that match. Like, 100%. Because, like, we had the dual burning magnet zone. We had Dragonite to find supporter cards. We had Stoutland to shut down his supporter cards. And we had Obstagoon to make him have four cards in hand. That's how the deck works. And that's what we needed to see. Uh, so, guys, there we go. We actually had the deck work. Uh, I was against a mill deck, so whatever. But the pressure was, like, so strong the first two games. Uh, first game, we just, like, were super bricked. Second game, maybe I could have played it better. Not sure. Uh, but, guys, hope you enjoyed the video. At least we won a fan Friday. Uh, see you on Monday. Alrighty. Bye.